Ah, shit. Fucking bowling. Not bad. Okay, let's see how everyone did. Sue, you got a 142. Dad, a solid 228. Thank you very much. Bill, 60. Maureen, 61. Kevin, zero. <laughs> hey, you tied with Grandpa Bill, and he's dead. I've seen blind people with no arms do better. Yeah, well, they're not emotionally suffering like I am. Oh, hey, Alice, please touch my wing wing again. Shut up! Okay, okay, leave Kevin alone, you two. He's in pain. All right, and you're his fucking family, so act like it. All right. Time for a new game. Lead us off, Maureen. Oh, can I go play in the game room instead? Me too. They have that cool new video game. Fine. Here. Glad I shelled out a buck fifty rent you shoes to wear in the arcade. I'll go <laughs> with them to make sure they don't break any more laws. All right. <laughs> thanks for sticking up for me back there. I'm your father. Yeah, well, thanks. Do I still have to bowl? Yep. Now let's see if we can beat your high score of zero. Uh, you need to take the condoms out of the machine? Uh, yeah. Might be something wrong with them, for some reason. Hey! You buy any of them rubbers in there? Give them back. You don't want them. Do I hear a cricket? That's all I hear. Huh. Does that count for anything? You just lost me a hundred bucks! Sorry, buddy. First time bowler, long time idiot. <laughs> Won't happen again. <sighs> Thanks a lot. I just saved your life. You need a heavier ball. Hang on. Use this one. Bet it's got a strike in it. This ball, it actually came from. Uh... Yeah, that rack. There's a shitload of them. <clears throat> hey! I got one! I got the little one in the corner! The pinky pin! Yeah, you did! Way to go, buddy! Knocking just one over is probably harder than knocking them all over, right, Dad? Well... Sure. What is the point of this game? You make dots! It's amazing! Shh. I'm trying to concentrate! I got a free dot! Whoa, she's making so many dots! The future is a fucking miracle, I tell you. My kid's gonna eat that up. <laughs> I guess it's pretty good when you get them all down. Yeah. Who says you're not good at math? What? Nothing, nothing. Listen, uh... So how you doing? How's Kevin? Dad, every time we try to have a talk like this, we just end up getting in a fight. I know we do. But that's just because we're so similar. Ah. Uh... <laughs> I know! It sucks! Look. I turned out screwed up, because my dad screwed me up. But I don't want you to be screwed up. Wow. You never said anything like that before. I know. When you're a dad, you don't want to admit that you're human. I mean, <laughs> I mean, I know you kids see me as some sort of super man. Villain? W what? Nothing. I don't want us to be the way I was with my dad. And then let years go by before it's too late to make it better. So that's why I want to check in with you every once in a while. I know you're pretty torn up about Alice. Nah, only when I think about her. And, well, any other time, really. It's not gonna be easy getting over her. No, I, I, I see that. And I'm sorry I didn't understand that at first. I, I guess I just thought it was puppy love. Dad, what me and Alice had was grown dog love. I know. I know. I, I mean, we were doing stuff that would make a puppy explode. I got it. I got it. Kevin, this may surprise you. But you're not the first person in the world to feel this way. When I was your age, I was so in love with this beautiful blonde. Even though I was so crazy about her, she dumped me. Mom dumped you? No, I'm not talking about mom. This was Phyllis Hiberman. Ew, you had a girlfriend before mom? Uh-huh. Was she cute? Ah, uh, she was gorgeous. All hands on deck. Hoo-hoo, <laughs> ooga Well, not as gorgeous as your mom, but yeah, anyway. After she broke up with me, boy, I was a wreck. I thought I was gonna die without her. I tried everything to get her back, but she started dating Jack Drasky, and they got married and moved to Rhode Island, but after a while, I got over it. And then I met your mom. Take that, Phyllis. And you and mom have been together ever since, huh? Nah, we were on and off for a while. Had a real big fight back in 58. 
It's about me applying to flight school before she was finished with college. Broke up for a bit, but we took our time to cool off. And then we got back together, and it was better than before, because we knew we were meant for each other. Then what happened? Well, <laughs> you happened. And the rest, as they say, is history. So I should stop chasing Alice around and play it cool, and if we're meant to be, it'll be. Yeah, and if you're not, you won't, and you'll be okay. So try not to worry. And don't tell your mom about Phyllis Hiberman. She's her cousin. I could have been a stereo salesman, living in Miami. Yeah, shirt on button in my navel, drinking mojitos, banging Cuban refugees every night. But no, I had to make my mom happy and be a man of God. <laughs> oh, hi, Maureen. Hi, Father Pat. Are priests allowed to drink? It's the only thing we're allowed to do. You gotta have faith that things are gonna be okay, right? I mean, you have to. You're right, I do. Do you still have your faith? No. Aw. But you're a nice man, and I don't want you to be sad. There's people who need you. Like Cuban women in Miami? Sure. Amen. Can I get a whiskey double, please? One ice cube? Keep your fingers out of the glass this time. Hey, gotcha! <clears throat> your taillight's broken, dirtbag! Look at those kids of ours. They're okay. Yeah, they're not screw-ups. They just screwed up. All they needed was a little family time. Yeah. For all that parenting we did today, who knew the answer would be in a bowling alley? Since it was my idea, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, speaking of family time, I think I want to invite my mom and sister for Christmas. Wow, you really are drunk. <laughs> <laughs> I know! I know, they're the worst! And I want to invite Lewis! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah! Let's pile it on! But not your fucking father. I'm drunk, not concussed. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it'll be fine, as long as we keep the eggnog flowing. Speaking of flowing... Time to pee for me, old oh, Frankie's, he's gotta pee. Ah, shit. What are you doing, Frankie boy? No. Walk away. Okay, last one, I promise. But there's no way it'll fit. Ah, shit. God damn it. There's nothing in there, Frank. It's just gonna be empty, you fucking loser. <sighs> oh my god. Holy shit, there's so much here. <gasps> I found you, you son of a bitch. Daddy, I got high score, come see. Don't bother me, honey. Daddy's having family time.